I'm Jackie. And I'm Stacy. And we're here from the Six Flags Academic Adventures team. And welcome to the Bone Zone. Today we're going cuckoo for cockatoos because today's topic is all about bird characteristics. Scientists group animals together by the characteristics they have in common. To be considered a bird, for example, you have to have certain key characteristics. Some of these include being warm-blooded, having wings, being covered in feathers, having the ability to lay eggs, and having a beak. Now you may be wondering where Stacy went. Don't worry, she didn't fly away. She left the bone zone in search of a friend who could help us demonstrate some of these features. Hi everyone, it's me again, and I'm located right here in our wild walkway inside our theme park. This area is home to some of my favorite animals. Hi again, and I am joined today by Harley. Hey, wait a minute, I, I don't know if this is working. Can you test this for me? Okay. You know what, never mind, back to what I was saying. Now Harley is in fact a blue and gold macaw. These guys are native to Central and South America. And today we're gonna see if he is in fact a bird. Now Harley's gonna help us showcase some of those characteristics of birds. All birds are warm blooded. Hey Harley, are you warm blooded? Okay, I thought so. In addition, they're covered in feathers and have wings. Birds also have beaks for eating some of their favorite things like nuts and seeds. Now Harley is a boy, but if he had a mate, she would definitely lay eggs. Harley, thank you so much for showcasing all those characteristics today. Give me a high five. Looks like Harley is indeed a bird. Well, you knew that, didn't you? Hey Stacy. Yes, Jackie? I heard that parrots, like Harley the macaw, are really intelligent. Is that true? Absolutely that's true. Harley here knows a variety of different behaviors and vocalizations, and he can even pick out colors when asked. Ah! Ah! Funny! <laughs> Now the behaviors you just saw are extensions of his natural abilities. Here at Six Flags, we just put them on a cue or a signal with the help of positive reinforcement. Wow, Stacy and Harley, that was awesome! Well, I bet some of you are wondering why we haven't talked about the ability to fly when talking about birds. You're just gonna have to tune in next time to learn about that and more. Until next time, make it a wild day.